uh, I noticed Kron Kwasoni and Ina were constantly 24 7 24 7 like throughout the whole ride they were like talking about one topic and I don't know if they I think Crony would probably be fine with it, but I don't know about Ina. If they, uh, they let's let's say they talked about like manga <laughs> the whole time, and I'm like the whole time I'm just like kind of like listen, like not listening purposefully, but they're right behind me and next to me, so you know I just like hear it, and I'm like, what what what's going on? Why do they know everything, ev every single piece? of creation that they talk about they're like oh yeah i know that one i saw that one and yeah oh, oh this one yeah that totally uh, I, I, I know that one i know that one oh, uh, and they the whole time they talk about these things i'm like how come they read all of them they huh how <laughs> how do they know every single thing they read like they just know and, and so uh, i turn around i'm like uh, how 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 is, what? How? <laughs> and then the uh, crony in detail explains to me uh, how they're all they all have like the same tropes and you know they just like happen to all know the same ones and blah blah blah. Yeah, webtoons. <laughs> I I accidentally misspoke one time and I was like weebtoons and <laughs> like wait that's not that's not even that unfitting. And then I um, I told Kony, yeah, sorry, I can't really relate because I don't read that kind of stuff. I don't read manga either and I don't really watch anime. And then, then Kwasoni uh, connected with me. I felt connected because she was like, yeah, actually, I also don't watch anime at all. I'm like, oh my god, okay, why? And we both like kind of agreed that we just maybe kind of grew, grew out of it and... It's just like we, we don't feel the tingle anymore and don't feel so... And then one thing I gotta say, Kwasani! <laughs> uh, I, I was really surprised because like the last time I saw her, I felt like she was dressing more like could say tomboyish, but I don't wanna necessarily say tomboy. Just it just was like not dress. It was just like, you know, pants and all that. So I was like, hmm. Naruhodo, that's her style. But then this time, I feel like I had a completely different impression of her because she was really girly and she was wearing dress and and while well, her makeup was so pretty and she was just really, really, really cute and uh, like uh, had a different aura than usual. So I told her that, that I was surprised about it and she was very amused with it too. <laughs> the versatility of Kwasoni. She dressed up for the occasion. I don't know. I don't know. I don't. I really don't know what's like more common with her. I saw like two sides of her now, and uh, I don't know which one is the the more common one. Mm. 